Frederick George Cotman was a British painter who was born on August 14, 1850 in Ipswich, United Kingdom. He died on December 11, 1920. Frederick George Cotman belonged to the Romanticism art movement and was part of the Norwich School of Painters. His works focused mainly on landscape and portrait genres, although he also painted interiors. Cotman's paintings were characterized by their romantic and poetic style, featuring dramatic landscapes and intense colors that conveyed a sense of emotion and awe. As a member of the Norwich School, Cotman was influenced by the works of other prominent artists of his time, including John Constable and J.M.W. Turner. Frederick George Cotman was a part of a close-knit artistic community in Norfolk, where he worked alongside other notable painters of the Norwich School and developed friendships with them. He was influenced by the natural beauty of the area and often painted local landscapes, which later became some of his most famous works. Cotman's legacy as a romantic painter of landscapes and portraits solidified his status as an important figure in the history of British art. Frederick George Cotman was a gifted British artist who was born in Ipswich in 1850. He was raised in a family of artists and merchants, which had a significant impact on his artistic pursuits. Despite never living in Norfolk, he is loosely associated with the Norwich School of Painters, thanks to his family connection to John Sell Cotman, one of its leading figures. Cotman was a private pupil of William Thompson Griffiths, the head of Ipswich School of Art, where he developed a love for both oil and watercolors. He went on to create over 30 paintings in his lifetime, which were generally spent in London. Cotman was a founder member of the influential Ipswich Art Club and remained a member of it all his life. One of his most famous works, One of the Family, can now be found at the Walker Art Gallery in Liverpool. Throughout his career, Cotman continued to produce works that were well received, such as Farmyard and Dovecot, Nettlestead, which was painted in 1912. Cotman was clearly a talented artist who had a special ability to capture the essence of his subjects and evoke an emotional response from his viewers. Cotman died in Felixstowe in 1920, leaving behind a significant legacy. He had influenced and inspired other talented artists throughout his career, making an impact not only on British art but on the art world in general. Among those who were influenced by Cotman were his own cousin, John Joseph Cotman, as well as Frank Woolnow, the curator of the Ipswich Museum. Cotman's paintings can still be viewed today, including his stunning 1885 work, A Flood Tide at Clay Next the Sea, which showcases his incredible talent and impact on the world of art. In conclusion, Frederick George Cotman was a gifted British painter who left a profound impact on the landscape and portrait genres. His ability to capture the essence of his subjects and evoke an emotional response from his viewers was a testament to his artistic skill and creativity. As a member of the Romanticism art movement and part of the Norwich School of Painters, Cotman was heavily influenced by other prominent artists of his time, including John Constable and J.M.W. Turner. His legacy as a leading figure in British art was solidified through his influence on other talented artists, such as his cousin John Joseph Cotman and Frank Woolnow. Cotman's paintings continue to inspire and be admired by art enthusiasts around the world, including his stunning 1885 work, A Flood Tide at Clay Next the Sea.